Hey there folks, welcome back to Let's Play uh, Final Fantasy VI, episode 13. Yeah, I nearly got that wrong then. <laughs> is this Final Fantasy VI? I don't know. Uh, this is Goonie XI, and what we're going to do in this episode is take Gao's word for it that there's some treasure in here, some very shiny treasure. Now, where's it, Gao? Yeah, sniffer. <laughs> sniffer around. Like a dog. Sien, that shiny, shiny thing of Gao's is in here. Uh huh, uh huh. And where exactly might it be found, Sir Gao? Gao, forget. Ah, oh, don't be twat. Shall we look around? Seems we have no choice. Yeah. Yes. Oh yeah, between the last episode and this one, I did actually learn a new move or two with Gao. However useless they will be, but, you know. It's fine, it's fine. It's a very short dungeon, by the way. <laughs> is this it? The shiny treasure? If you can call it a dungeon, you can't even fight any enemies in here. Is this the shininess? Treasure, treasure! It has nothing but a dirty glass bowl. Kind of looks like it would fit over your head. Oh, it's for going underwater. I wonder if we could use this. Like those deep sea divers used to wear. I, I've never actually seen deep sea divers wear that sort of thing with the big fish bowl on their head and... A big marini suit, like in Bioshock. Maybe it's old fashioned. Hmm. Maybe. This looks just like Leith River, doesn't it? This little bit by you. I think it does. I should have really healed up before us come in. Oh my god, I forgot about this. These rapids look quite rapid. Oh, no kidding. But it's the only way to make it in time to meet up with the others. Uh, I forgot to set the timer. Let's do that now, shall we? There we go. Oh, oh, gow. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> he doesn't want to be left behind. It's a bit sad. Ah. <laughs> he only just met us and he's quite sad about leaving us. Now, this is something new to Final Fantasy VI. It looks a bit shite in today's standards, but it, at the time, I think, I think it was probably pretty good. Probably. Battles. These are all set battles. You can use a raid shirt. Should we give Exercise a go? I don't know what any of them do. It doesn't particularly matter. They're not exactly hard enemies, don't you? But yeah, I did not enter it incorrectly. Don't start. Fang. And as you can see, Gao has like a yellow glow above his head. Not. It looks a bit yellow to me anyway. And that's because he's in that monster's um, status effect, in a sense. So he's only using those abilities from that monster. It's gone now, though, because the battle's finished. Here comes another one. Is it? Is it? Is it? Yeah, we'll go left. We'll just go with the hours telling us. It doesn't really matter if you go left or right. I think you just have less battles if you pick the right ways, you know. Let's try the Nautiloid. Yeah. Oh, that was shite. See, it's so random. You can use one of a couple of moves, and some of them are really bad against certain enemies, and you don't want to be using them, and he uses them anyway. You know? Anyway. I'm going to try and heal C in that for a bit now, if we get the opportunity to. No, not ink again. Oh, bollocks. Sien has been stopped, that's what the pink means. I'm sure we saw it in that tutorial at the very start of the game, but... Yeah. Never mind, I won't heal them up for now. We'll... We'll just kill the enemies off. There's gonna be plenty more battles coming. And if Sien... Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Got Phoenix down out of it, so I guess... I guess we'll be using that pretty soon. <laughs> We're gonna have to. Go is gonna have to get going with his Phoenix Downs. Yeah. These are quite tough enemies just because they have so much health, as you've seen. Yeah. <laughs> That's about all I gotta say about them, really. They're weak against lightning, I'm sure. We better heal Sabin up a bit just because 
just because. Look how low his health was. 50 HP with a potion. They're useless already, and we're not even far into the game. Not really. No. You better use a couple of potions, though, just because they... This isn't the last battle underwater. We won't get a chance to heal at all, so we might as well. There we go, he's down! She turned Sab and gained a level. Good, good. And quite a bit of money then, too. 716 gil from one battle. Right now, that's enough for a Phoenix Stone. With change, you know? Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is so. That makes me so dizzy. So dizzy. We'll go right. Why not? Just choose left or right on the analog stick, you know? Keep on. Oh my god, I, I don't like the effect. <laughs> It really makes me dizzy. I'm not even over exaggerating or anything. Like the people who say uh, the 3DS makes them dizzy, makes them go blind, it kills them. <laughs> Seriously, just turn the 3D off. Anyway. <clears throat> I suppose that's what's good about the 2DS. You can just you don't have to worry about the 3D. Even though it's a switch on the 3DS to turn 3D off, you don't have to worry about doing that even. You can be extra lazy. <laughs> We're done. We have made it to the end of the underwater section. And this dungeon will be... Um... Yeah, didn't last long, did it? Oh, there's more. <laughs> I didn't even realise. Come on, heal. Oh, we can't heal. I thought that was a healing one. Okay, well. I have to go down there, won't we? Let's keep going, folks. Just, just, good. Greenberry. We just got one of those on the belt. It doesn't look like we needed to buy them at all, but... Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, I've not got one on already. Got an half percent better HP as well. I mean, chuck them on. Seriously. As you can see, Gao has a feather. That means he's in float. And that's because of the enemy skill, the rage that we just used. It puts him in float. Weird little effects like that. I do. I do like them, I'll be honest. A door in a cave. Wow. Wow. Where are we now? Okay, back up in the water. That would have been the perfect time to have healed up a bit. Would have been a nice place to have had a save point as well, but... No. There we go. Doesn't matter anyway, we are done with all that underwater crappery. Although it's not crap, it's just... <laughs> just a term, okay. Ah, thank God. I don't know why, but I always dread that water part. I really do. It's very bound for South Figaro. Still need to shop. We better shop a bit, yeah. Let's see what... <laughs> Let's see what they got in here. Nikia. Have we been here before? No. It looks very similar, do not it, to somewhere else, but apparently it's not. Some good weapons here. We got the Katetsu in the last town. Mithril goes to Mithril Spear. I think we'll get that for... Fredgar. Why not? We can always check the attack and stuff when we sort of get him. You know, get him back. Armor shop. I do like how they put it out in the... Like a market store or something in this town. I do like that. Let's see. We got... I think we got the best stuff already. Two more. Let's have a look. I think I want to get a silk robe for Terra, just just to see if there's much difference, you know. There are a couple of barrels. I am actually pretty certain that there's one or two barrels around here that will give you something handy. Let's go in the pub. <laughs> Everyone loves a pub. Now, that strange old man lives in a little cabin near the leaf. I helped deliver his son 13 years ago. It was a problem birth. The mother didn't survive and the man couldn't take it. Went loony he did. Ah, oh, that was where we, uh... He wanted us to fix his clock, fix his lawnmower, fix his stove. He went loopy because of his wife dying in the birth. That's... That's why. Oh, hello. Whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> How dare you? Licentious howler. Off, off with thee. I don't know what licentious means, but it can't be good. Oh, don't be a stick in the mud. Let's just have some fun. How do you like these? I call this one Humpty, and this one Dumpty. 
Oh my god, such a slap. <laughs> oh, seems not like in that. Humpty? Dumpty? Sian did have a great fall here, didn't he? Sian, you're too easy. Th thou art unaffected by these charms? When the benefits of all my years of aesthetic training. Ah, Sabin loves it. I oh, don't leave me standing here all alone. <laughs> oh my god. It's because he's just married, I'm sure that's something to do with it. Enough of that. A proper woman should have modesty and, and decency. And. Rant, rant, rant. Hmm. <laughs> oh, Sian. Ah, that was fun. Handsome young thing, why don't you come have a drink with me? <laughs> Sam and our book mind, all of them have been lost to the Empire, so we can't get a ship to them right now. Shame, shame. We are definitely going to be finishing off Sabin's scenario this episode, so that's, uh, that's nice. Right, get out of my way, woman. Right, thank you. Item shop, I think we'll have a look, see what we got here. We bought loads of new equipment, so we haven't got to worry about that money-wise, you know. We'll get a tent. It's always nice to have a spare tent or two. Another two Phoenix Downs. They're always handy as well. Smoke bomb, what do they do? Another party to escape from battle. Do you think we should get one just for emergencies? I can't see us needing it, but... Like I said, just for emergencies. And just filling up the inventory gaps a little bit. Don't worry too much about it. I think we'll rest in the inn again. Because we're a bit low on health. Even though we don't really need to. But I just want to. I like to have my characters up on full health and stuff, you know. Every opportunity I get, even if you're about to get healed at some point really soon. I like to like to do it. So, yes. Is there anything up here? Or oh, clock. Elixir? Oh, it's elixirs. Nice. I don't know if I've told you before, but they fully heal a character, one character, in terms of both HP and MP, so very handy. One of the best items in the game, in fact. Where do you think we are now? I think we need to... Yeah, it's going to take us to South Figaro. Let's check the map a sec, just for a moment. See where we are. Right, yeah, okay. Level up out by there if you really want to. It'll be... Useful for what's coming up, I guess, but yeah, no, it's not. Nothing vital, nothing vital. Out the way, sir. Uh, please, please get out the way. Can I have some more? Uh, let's get on the ship. Yep, yeah, let's get going. Ferry's bound for South Figaro. No, I don't still need to shop at all. Hop aboard. We're already aboard. Yeah. Ah, look at the little ship. <laughs> it looks so tiny on a huge ocean. Nash is just a stone's throw away. I wonder if the others arrived safely. I wonder too. I'm sure they did. Oh! <laughs> Such a weirdo. And there we go, that is Sabin scenario all tied up. Quite neatly, I think. No boss at the end, like you would expect, I think. But, whatever. Right, the next scenario... We shall start in the next episode now, I think. I think that's um, the best way to do this. So, this has been Greeny XI. I hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you again in the next episode when we start the next scenario. Which one? That'll be a surprise. I'll, I'll leave that for you to figure out <laughs> or guess at. See you in a bit.